Tim Struthers and um, we farm down in the Blind River on a um, in the core core area of the Chilean needlegrass and we farm predominantly cattle and vineyard as well. Roughly 10 years ago now we went down there looking at doing a vineyard development. Um, we're aware of it was in the was in the district um, to the extent had no idea. Talking to the local biosecurity officer got them out. Yeah, the reality of the problem was huge. Um, but as it stood, it was pretty unproductive. But things have changed. There's new grasses, species, um, sprays for the needle grass, and, um, and that's making the management so much easier. If anything, production's actually gone up with the work we're doing. Well, firstly, the spread risk was the most important one. Doing development down there, a lot of contractors, big washdowns put in, spent a lot of time checking down machinery if it was left or it wasn't taken away until jobs were complete. We wash everything down, goes off the place. I personally wash them down myself. It's inspected. Council biosecurity officers initially were inspecting and then subcontracted out to Armour Guard and they are at hours notice. You can get a get someone on site, go over the vehicles and make sure everything's done before it's before it leaves the property. And it's a timing thing from what we learned in the first couple of years without the task force of when it was best controlled. Um, using glyphosate. Um, it is not super competitive but in the right environment will outperform a lot of species. So we go and do the spray sort of November period and we summer fallow it. Now that, I mean it's just it's good sta standard farming practice but um, it allows us to get back in. The moisture is retained in these, these are really rich clay soils and uh, it dries out the top two or three inches but the rest of it, it stays really moist under there and then we can hook back into it sort of end of January, early February with a cropping program for winter so I've been going into, you can either go to rapes, barleys, um, work really well after the task force and you get some really good results out of them and then early winter or late winter go back into another roundup, spray it out and then we can start getting back into some more permanent pastures. Really showing up and working well is the lucerne, um, coxfoot, um, plantain, we've got white clovers that are coming away really well still. Um, sub clovers, which are naturally in the soil, so we haven't put too much of them in the mix, uh, and they really bounce back after task force. But yeah, mainly the grasses, which is affects the most, is the coxfoot, getting that in there, and the lucerne helps um, fix nitrogen, and then the plantain, which is really good for animal health and grows really well and hardy, and it survives the drought plus the task force. So that's what I'm concentrating on now. And once that the permit's established, it's yeah, it's. Um, the pastures of chalk and cheese. I mean, it's, we're running dairy cattle here at the moment. It's a good season for it, but we're, yeah, and they're performing, really performing. We're part of Chilean Needle Action Group, and um, yeah, talk, talking, talking, getting in contact with council, biosecurity, the likes of ourselves, and the guys on the group. Um, there's a huge amount of knowledge being out there, and it's just putting it, getting into the right, right areas. It is a challenge. But it's also rewarding as well because we're seeing some really good results and you can see it on the bottom line as well. Huge amount of avenues, obviously the council and biosecurity are well up with it, but if they don't feel comfortable, some people don't. There is the Chilean in Action Needlegrass group, there's, there's the likes of myself and, and another either eight or ten members on, on the group. There's also a Facebook page, the Chilean Needlegrass Awareness Facebook page. It's a great site, plenty of people on that. You ask questions, you'll get some answers. There's a whole range of avenues like that.